Okay, here's a problem you might see. Again, two numbers have a sum of 18 and a difference of 8. Write and solve a system of equations to find the numbers. All right, think about it. As always, our first step when you're tackling a problem like this is going to be to write a let statement to define your variables. So let's use our old standbys, x and y. Let x be our first number, and we'll have y be the second number. Okay, so now we know we're gonna use x and y to represent these two numbers that we're looking for. Now let's go up to our problem here. It tells us that the numbers have a sum of 18. Well, the way we get a sum is by adding numbers. So I know that x plus y equals 18. That's the first equation in my system. And they have a difference of 8. So I can say that x minus y, excuse me, x minus y is 8. So there's the system of equations that we're going to use to figure out what these two numbers are. Now, if we're going to solve this system by substitution, we're going to need to get one of these variables by itself. It's probably going to be easiest for me to take get rid of this x. So if I took the equation x plus y equals 18, and if I subtract an x from both sides of the equation, I can say that y equals 18 minus x. And since y is the same thing as 18 minus x, I can take this 18 minus x and plug it in for that y. So now we have x minus, and instead of saying y, we're going to say 18 minus x equals 8. Now this is one where you want to be careful because of this minus sign here. Remember we substituted 18 minus x for this y. Our original equation said x minus y. So x minus, we essentially need the opposite of 18 and the opposite of this negative x. We need to distribute that negative sign. So this becomes x minus 18 negative times negative is going to give you a positive x equals 8. When you combine like terms, x plus x gives you 2x minus 18 equals 8. We would add 18 to both sides. 2x is 26. Divide by 2 and x is going to be 13. Since x plus y equals 18, when x is 13, I know that y is going to be 5. Notice that these two numbers do have a sum of 18 and a difference of 8. That's how you would set up and solve that system of equations.